So I went to the John Mayer concert this weekend and it was way fun in Vegas. And everything was all fine until the last night. I was about to get in the shower when I noticed this huge moth on the wall. Which is kind of scary because I hate moths. So I told myself that it was probably dead and got in the shower. And then when I got out of the shower, I was changing and it was a mirror. It was like 2.30 in the morning and I didn't want to wake anybody else up. And I didn't know where the moth killer was. So I just quickly got my stuff and ran out of the bathroom. I had to use the other bathroom to brush my teeth and was just hoping that it wouldn't go in my room because there was a lamp that I thought it would like the warmth of the other bathroom. So I made sure that my door was like almost all the way shut and then I ran and brushed my teeth. And I came back in my room and shut the door and I thought all was well in the world. But all wasn't right in the world because I turned around and the moth was in my room on the wall and it was like the size of a 50 cent piece. So I looked around my room for something I could kill it with, and um, all I could find was this pillow, and not one that I was sleeping on, but it would have to do. So I moved the chair that was by the door, and I grabbed the pillow, and I counted to three, and I jumped in the air, and I whacked that moth as hard as I could with the pillow. So it was kind of scary, but it was 3 a.m., and I didn't want to wake anyone up or make them think that I had broken something, so I just screamed inside myself really loud. And all was good in the world, except there was a dead moth on the floor, so I tried to roll over it with the chair, but it didn't work. So I had to go get two tissues so I could pick it up and then throw it away. So the moral of the story is that you should make sure that your door is closed and your lights are turned off, and that you should have screens on your windows and doors so that moths don't get inside. But this because if you don't, this story could happen to you. And it was really scary at the time. I promise, everything's scary at 2.30 in the morning. I also want to mention that this is a true story. This really, really happens, and so beware.